everyone, it's Byron here from Black Ops Toys, and today we are unboxing the MMS-484 Doctor Strange from Infinity War. With the new Spider-Man coming out, and with the new Doctor Strange coming out uh, a little bit after that, we want to reload this guy. It's going to be great for if you don't want to wait for, you know, two years, three years for Hot Toys to release the next Doctor Strange, you can make your own with the kit rush. So, as you can see, this guy is packed full of accessories. He comes with so much stuff. Tons of options with this guy. So. Look at all that stuff. So, I will separate this piece. We'll get into the body first, of course. have the Sorcerer Supreme himself. Head sculpt is just incredible. Hot Toys just does such a great job with their head sculpts. They're so great. Everyone is hand painted. It's good looking. Then you have the uniform itself, which is his blue uniform. You have, there's a couple different layers. There's a, an under shirt, I believe, and then there's this over tunic, which is the darker blue material. And then you have the lighter blue material tunic over the top of it. And then you have the belts. I think these are two separate pieces. You can see back here, that's how you get it off with the Velcro right there. Then you have his gauntlets. And you have the boots down here, which have nice weathering and have kind of the blue wrap around it. Is that fabric? The wrap? The wrap? Yeah. It's cool. Fabric. Very cool. And I believe these are wired, yeah. So these down here are wired at the bottom. And they're uh, they're not wired in the middle, but they are wired at the bottom. And then if I'll pull this up. So you have, here's the bottom of that darker blue tunic down here. And you have kind of some bluish gray pants at the bottom. Posability is, you know, the hot toy standard. Great posability. Legs might be a little, oh no, legs are amazing. Tons of posability with the legs. And then, where should we start all of this? Let's get into the cape. Here you have his cape, which is, I believe, magnetic. Fits right there, and yes, there's a, I believe there's a magnet in here, you can see, yeah. So no, the magnets are actually here. You can see under the fabric that little circle magnet right there. So those fly right on there, and that keeps keeps them on him. See, it has kind of the shoulder pad on one side, and then this collar would obviously flip down. But it is amazingly detailed, and it has a wire in the bottom right here. All of that is all wired. Wired is always great for posability, because capes tend to not sit right unless they're wired or they have enough weight. And this has both of those. See okay. on the back, yeah. uh, extra fabric. Have extra set of wrist pins in case you break them. You have your dynamic stand. You have your first set of the effects, which uh, we'll get into. This also comes with these dioramas. This is for taking photos. This will fit in a standard detox shelf. Let's see. Flips open. Oops. Oh, cool. Yeah. So, excellent diorama for taking photos. Set that back there. And now we can get into the effects in the hands. So we have tons of hands for the different effects. So you have kind of your standard hands, your open palm, your fist hands. And if you can see, if you zoom up close on these, you can see they have the detail of the scars from uh, when he messed up his hands. Just excellent, excellent detail. And then you have sort of the effects hands for the magic. Isn't that called the shocker? What? Okay. You have this one. Different detailed hands. It's kind of just a loose grip hand. Another hand like that. 
and then you have all of these different effects. So we'll get all these out here. A couple different rings. You have the time stone effects when he is using the time stone. You have this larger effect, double ring. You have the flame sword that he briefly uses in the Thanos fight. Or magic sword, I guess. You have the, I guess, uh, it's kind of like rope, but it's like magic uh, rope that he uses to hold on to the gauntlet. You have two larger effects, and if you can see, your hands slot in to little pieces right here so that it can hold oh, cool. hold these up. So that's what these little things on the back are for, to pose them with different hands. And then you have the little square rune effect with the same, same little pieces up there. You have the base stand, the Avengers logo, you have Doctor Strange on the bottom. And then you have the time stone itself, and I believe some sling rings. Let me open this without sending it everywhere. So these are the little sling rings that they use for teleporting, using magic and stuff. You get two of them, which is great in case you lose one. And then you have the time stones, or the Eye of Agamotto. So you have an opened time stone, showing the time stone. And then you have the closed version. Cool. Which is great. Like I said, there's so much accessories here, so much you can do, there's so much customizability, different photos, different poses. You can have him with the green effects opening the time stone, or you can have him with the orange effects and the time stone closed. And just a, a great figure, and again, the head sculpt is just so great. Hot Toys really nails the... I guess Benedict Cumberbatch isn't necessarily old, but in, in Doctor Strange, you know, he has the gray hair, and he's... Uh, Middle Age, they nail the older head sculpts and the Middle Age head sculpts, they're just, they're amazing. Really great with the weathering and the details of the skin. If you like this video, you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Pinterest. If you like the video down below, let us know how you like to pose this guy in your detolf. Uh, you can hit the notification bell down below to be notified of more awesome content like this guy.